Hey guys, what's up? Give everybody a minute to get in here. Get all this go live stuff, see how it works. Going with Facebook today. It says it should pop up here. It's a little different for us. There's a delay, it seems. Here we go. It says go live on Facebook. So here we go. We're going to go live. All right, we are live. Hey, Facebook, what's up? Doing the podcast live on here today. Why? We'll get to towards the end of this. It will be available later on YouTube as well. But let's get into the news of the day. Yes, I'm sitting in my robe again. It's freaking freezing. It's pretty cold outside. Let's see, what's the weather? High around 20, morning wind chill, 0 to minus 10. Tell you though, walking outside in the dark this morning is really neat. The snow was like glittering. That's kind of cool. We will be warming up later in the week. I'll make this a quick show today, but if you have any comments, pop in on the Facebook. That's Naptown Buzz on Facebook. Hopefully you guys got alerts about this. Hey, the wife found it. How you doing, babe? Switched on over to Facebook. So is it loud enough? Can you hear me? Food trucks. Their pretzel wagon still isn't at Gateway. He and KG Slider Station are at United Health One, which is up on the northwest side. If you know where Fox 59 is, it's over that direction. Pocadillo, IU Revenue Services out on the east side. Serendipity once again is up in Carmel. Next Gear Cafe. Box Burger. Doesn't, I don't think they're out today, but crew says they are back. Going to bring the sunshine, right? That's what's going on with the food trucks. There are a few out today. Of course, as I said, it'll be nicer this weekend, so hopefully we'll start to see a few more coming out. Jump into sports. Pacers. Of course, you saw that yesterday. They beat the Jazz. IU. They play tomorrow, I believe. Colts, we think we got a new coach. Yada, yada, yada. Draft talk, draft talk. We'll see what happens there. Other big news here in town. Brian Esposito has appointed uh, the tribe manager because uh, Andy Barquette, our manager last year, where did he go? To, was it the Marlins or Yankees? Something like that. He, he got him a major league gig, though. One and done. Did a great job here, though. He actually went to the playoffs for the first time in years. There's IndyCar yesterday. They introduced the new car. Mario Andretti was a fan, I heard. So, some other team news. Of course, the big one last night, the Boilers. No holding these guys back, man. 7-0, Big Ten, 18-2 overall. Whooped the Wisconsin Badgers, 78-50. Led the entire game. They came out of the gates, hit four three pointers. We're up twelve to nothing to start this thing. Crazy. Boilers are rolling. Over to the NBA. Pacers still sitting at number six. Of course, they didn't play last night. So they're nine and a half games back from Boston. We got Boston, Toronto, Cleveland, Miami, Washington, Indiana, Milwaukee, and Detroit. So if the playoffs were today, we would be playing Cleveland, which would be Cleveland was that last week. So there's that. That's your sports news for today. Not a whole lot going on in the blog community. Geeking Indiana had a new one yesterday. Their Tuesday tidbits at Tony Trucks on his crew. Friends over at Indy's Child, they have a it's a workshop at Connor Perry they're talking about. You should go check that out. Of course, Town Post. If you want some political type news, go check that out. It's up on the north side, of course. 
Look at events real quick. Buddy Bob Birchfield is five of the day. It's roundindy.com if you haven't been there. Go. Subscribe to Bob. Great guy. Disney on Ice at Banker's Life Fieldhouse. Sound of Music at the Embassy Theater. Craig Brenner live at the Arts Garden. Sully's Grill Cooking Class at Sullivan Hardware. Sounds interesting. Pat Sullivan, funny dude. And again, the Hearthside Suppers at Connor Prairie. Now this next thing I'm going to show you, I'm just going to tell you one thing. Aliens. For those of you listening to the podcast, you may have heard this. There was some uh, commotion up in Detroit. Yes, Michigan, Illinois. I think some people even in Ohio were claiming they heard this, saw this. But here, let's let's watch this video real quick. See if it pulls up on the stream. Guys, just driving along, driving along, driving along. Bam! Aliens. Yeah, aliens are my thought. Of course, they're thinking it's a meteor. Of course, you get on there, you know, all the conspiracy theorists. Of course. Some of the comments here are kind of hilarious. It's an angel. Do angels burn up on re-entry? Yes, unless they're covered in angel dust. Uh, funny. Aliens. Would have been cool to hear. Probably would have creeped you out though, right? Let's get on over to what I'm going to be busy with today. Of course, if you don't know, I do a lot of WordPress work. We use WordPress every single day. 100 sites or more, probably. But anyway, WordPress 4.9.2 security and maintenance release was put out. This is security. Yes, there are some fixes, but get this up. If you have normal WordPress installed, it should have kicked over these updates automatically. This isn't a major release, it's a minor release, so... Make sure all that took place and upgrade your plugins. Hackers are hitting the WordPress hard. They've actually been nailing one of my sites all week trying to hack into it. So watch yourself. If you need help, get a hold of me over at Watershed Studio. That's where I do all the geeky stuff. Enough of that, though. Let's get to what's on my mind today. Why we are on the Facebook instead of YouTube. Put this up for a minute so you can read it. But actually before this came through last night, I'm laying in bed and this pops through, but I was discussing this prior to this happening that I wanted to go with Facebook because we have a much larger audience than YouTube. And then I'll just put the videos that are recorded locally up on YouTube. So we'll see how that works today. Hopefully it's recording fine. But I was wanting to do live streams on YouTube since we have, or on Facebook, because we have like 3,000 subscribers. YouTube, we get a lot of views, but we only have like 90 subscribers. YouTube has been just hosing everybody. Last week when we started doing these frequent live stream podcasts, every single video got demonetized. For those of you who don't know what that means, it means we get absolutely no money for it. They're showing these ads, we get no money. The way it is, we don't get much money anyway. We get uh, maybe $100 a year. Covers like a month of hosting. Not much at all. Anyway, they sent us this thing said, Hey, uh, February 20th, you're out of here. You can't monetize anything. We're taking it all away from you because you don't have 4,000 hours of views, which I believe we have the hours of views, but you have to have 1,000 subscribers. So like even for their little super chat thing they do, you have to have 1,000 subscribers. We don't qualify. YouTube is not our focus. It's basically a place for us to put our videos up, people to watch them. We don't have to pay for all the hosting fees of that. So you know what? We're going to switch this stuff over to Facebook. Supposedly Facebook is only... Uh, what is it? 720? Hoping it really is 1080. I'm broadcasting right now in 1080, so we'll see how this shows up. But regardless, we're going to go over there because look at this. 
We have 3,500 of you guys here on Facebook. More people are on Facebook. Your apps are going to pop up when we do this. It's like last week we were putting, we we're scheduling the live ones on YouTube, and they weren't showing up to some people for hours. Some people didn't even get notices at all. What good does that do if no one's in here to watch this? So that's where we are with that. Rest of this week, I'm going to see how this Facebook deal does. Let us know what you guys think, if you like the Facebook videos. Of course, we'll put it on YouTube as well to see how the traffic does to videos that weren't streamed live. So that's all for today, guys. Try to catch you again tomorrow. Of course, I don't even know if I said it. Today is Wednesday, January 17th, 2018. So I'll catch you later, guys. Bye.